I think we were a little lackadaisical to start the game. Uh, I think they uh, stressed the entire time before the game even started, a week of preparation, that that's a team that is going to give us everything they had. And I mean, you know, tip, hats off to Duquesne. They did a great job coming in. Uh, yeah, we had high expectations. Yeah, we wanted to win by more. We wanted to play better. Uh, honestly, the discipline factor was the biggest thing. So um, we just need to get back to how we've been playing So uh, and then make improvements from there. So uh, You know, uh, everything doesn't go as planned. You know, we, we set up a couple plays before the game. Like, we got a script and everything. So uh, once we got once we got the plays, we only have to see what type of defense they were in. Then once that happened, then we just started getting it going. Like. Um, I think we're by far the most vet. On the on the defensive side, um, but as a football player, you have to have the next man up mentality. Uh, Panay Pavi, he he stepped up when I was missing in uh, week zero, um, and Cheyenne and uh, Kanai they had a they had a terrific game uh, this past week. Um, you just have to have that men uh, uh, mentality that your your number is going to get called soon, and uh, when it's called, you just got to answer the answer the bell. And what was so great about it is that they did. We're going up to San Jose, a place where we've we've had great football games, close football games. Um, we got a team that's coming off a bye, probably the best winless football team in America right now. They're very good up front. They got athletes all over the field. They went up and played Washington State. They played Oregon, and the one thing you notice is they're still playing very hard. So even though they lost those two games, there's still a belief um, in their program. That, that playing hard and, and something's going to crack and, and we are ripe for the menu for them. They're just, there's no way this team is going to come out not ready to play, in my opinion. If, if they're going to come out play ready at Oregon in a tough environment and, and play pretty well, um, they're excited for us to come there. I'm sure they are, and, and we better be ready for it. I mean, every week is a new challenge. Uh, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just excited and blessed that we, we get another shot uh, as a 2018 unit to play with each other. Um, so we just have to take advantage of every opportunity that we have and uh, so far so good. So uh, I'm, I'm really enjoying my last year here and, uh, and I know that the whole defense is just fired up. And I think Coach Batoon and that staff, the defensive staff has done an excellent job keeping them mentally uh, prepared for every situation. And, and you know, as the season dra drags on, you know, where are we in the season and, and what do we got to do to win football games? They're, they're going to give us their best game, guaranteed. Um, it doesn't matter the record, doesn't matter. Uh, what people are going to say. Um, they will give us their best, and we need to come in thinking that. Um, and, you know, I've had some good memories. I, the last time I was over at San Jose, it was a first road win, and I don't know how long. So um, that was an amazing experience, and uh, I, I don't want to go down there with uh, anything less. So uh, I'm excited for our team to get down there. I know we're uh, very, um, we're going to treat like a business trip, you know, just like every other trip. So. Um, with uh, improving on discipline this week, I think we'll end up uh, doing some good things on Saturday.